boost your brain power with these five steps. Hello champions, I'm Dr. Meghna Dikshit, author of the book You Matter, and I'm thrilled to welcome you to our channel. Here we explore the fascinating realms of mind and brain, share the secrets to success, help you heal your past and prepare for a brilliant future. If you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell. And to all our returning viewers, a heartfelt welcome. If you are ready to dive into the incredible world of brain potential, type dive in in the chat box right now. Let me share with you a story from the epic Mahabharat. When Arjun married Draupadi and took her home, as per his mother's wishes, Draupadi was married off to all the five Pandavas. Mutually, the brothers agreed that each brother would spend one year with Draupadi. During that period, no other brother would enter Draupadi's private quarters. However, it so happens that one day Arjun enters Draupadi's room to collect his gandiv, his dhanush, his bow. Arjun had to leave home and go into the forest as a punishment. During that time, Arjun acquires a lot of archery skills and comes back more strong than he was earlier, which benefits him in the war. When I read this story, I was mystified. Arjun was an adult. How was he able to learn something new in his advanced age? I had learned that our brain grows maximum from the age 0 to 8 years, post which the development of our brain slows down. I began to do my research. Here is what I discovered. The adult brain can generate new nerve cells. This is called neurogenesis. One of the most exciting part of our brain is hippocampus. It's the grey structure in the center of our brain. Hippocampus is responsible for learning, memory, mood and emotions. But this is also the unique structure of the brain where new neurons are generated. New research by scientists show that an adult brain produces 700 new neurons daily. Isn't that fascinating? But not all the new neurons that are born survive. In fact, maximum of those die. To survive the new neurons, need nutrients and connections with other neurons that are already thriving. I'm now going to give you some simple steps by which you can boost your brain power by providing the required nutrients to the new neurons being generated daily in your brain. If you want more, type give me more in the chat box. Now take a pen and paper and start writing. Step 1. Exercise Yes, you heard me right. Daily exercise can boost brain power. Studies have revealed that exercise can reveal brain's executive functions like planning, organizing, multitasking, etc. People who exercise regularly are less likely to get dementia. Exercise increases blood flow to the brain which also increases the delivery of oxygen and fuel to those nutrient-hungry neurons. The key is to exercise in the early morning to reap the maximum benefits. Step 2. Diet Like our body, our brain also need a good diet to keep it going and growing. Our earlier generations emphasized on a balanced meal. And that's the key. A home-cooked meal that has equal amounts of protein, fiber, good fats and carbohydrates is the key forward. Eating good amount of fruits, vegetables, nuts, seeds boost the fatty cells in our brain it's best to avoid saturated fats so say goodbye to packaged food understand that it is not just what you eat but how much you eat also matters studies have shown that eating 25 to 30 percent less than what you eat normally increases your lifespan brain function is improved improved memory power and coordination skills step three Practicing meditation regularly. Studies have shown that chronic stress can damage the brain. One way to increase brain power is to reduce the stress. You may say this is easier said than done in today's lifestyle. I get it. The most effective way is to practice for 10-15 minutes daily meditation. To just sit quietly with eyes closed, focus on your breath. With practice, you can increase the time to 30-60 to 60 minutes. Step 4 is deep listening. Any time you engage in activities that require communication, neurons need to fire and synapses need to function. 
stress or injury to the brain can challenge this communication process like meditation quieting the mind can benefit deep listening is nothing but taking your time to respond or speak in any conversation remembering to deep breathe before responding writing down what you want to say if you're feeling emotionally charged or overwhelmed practice to listen with your heart and not just ears have that one safe place or person where you can vent all your deep fears and frustrations and the last step is getting good sleep an adult requires 6 to 7 hours of deep restive sleep but in today's technology driven world we may be thinking that we are sleeping for 6 7 hours but in effect we may be getting just 2 3 hours of deep sleep inculcating a good sleep habit is a must to boost our brain power some of the tips are to fix a time to go to bed and wake up in the morning daily eat your last meal at least 3 hours before your bedtime switch off all your gadgets before 2 hours of your bedtime take a cool shower before bedtime make a habit of reading before your bedtime practice these five steps diligently and boost your brain power next time you read the news about that 85 year old grandmother learning to ride a plane don't be shocked she is just following these steps and increasing the brain power after all age is just a number right if you like the video make sure that you comment what did you like about the video and share this video with your family and friends and if you want more help from me to boost your brain then there are two links posted in the caption first register for my live seminar free to train your brain to achieve your goals and second you can purchase my book you matter through the link and start your personal growth journey with me until then next time